I was sick, and my grandson came over, and he said, you better call an ambulance. I was paralyzed from the waist down. They finally got my legs working enough that I could manage to get in and out of bed. When I came home from the hospital, my legs were leaking. The fluid was coming out of my legs. I didn't think they were ever going to heal. But they finally did. Alvina was referred to me for a wound care. It took quite a long time because it's a venous ulcer. Started with like simple wound care. Then we have to use the wrap to control the swelling. Started to get better. So now she's with me for maintenance. She comes in and we say talk to each other or say hello. And she sits down and she does my legs, what she has to do. We talk about everything. <laughs> She likes to chat with me, I like to chat with her, make her day better. Seeing someone's getting better and then healing, it makes me feel good, especially someone really in need, like can't get out of the house. I'm helping someone to get better. I didn't like myself when I came home from the hospital. I just wanted to die. Cody raises your spirits pretty good. <laughs> she builds you up when she's around you. We are not there as just a nurse. Sometimes we have to play different roles. Sometimes you have to be a PSW. Sometimes you have to be an advisor. Sometimes you have to be a caregiver. As a nurse, you have to be everything. I've had a lot of nurses in my time, and she's the nicest nurse I've ever had. She treats you good. She's got a super personality. She's a great person. She made me want to get better.